hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're all doing well so for those that have seen my short about my baptism you would have noticed how i mentioned that i will do the full story about my baptism for the new year so this is the video that i promised so the whole idea of me being baptised came from it actually came from me watching my brother get baptised and to me I didn't know the significance of it at that kind of age so it just looked like a lot of fun for me being dunked in water but later on I discovered what it meant and in order to be baptised you have to be committed and you have to actually mean it and not just do it because other people were doing it so I talked to my dad about it who was alive at the time and I talked to the kids pastor who was close to me and my family and we had a discussion about it and in the end they agreed that I could get baptised in about a year or two years time so it came to my baptism and unfortunately my dad wasn't there because he passed away by the time I got baptised. Um, so that was a bit of a conflicted thought because I wanted to get baptised but then am I really wanting to commit myself to God yet? But later on, with a lot of teaching and the people that were surrounding me at the time, I learned that whenever I go through a difficult situation, I need God because he's the one that helps me get through such a difficult time. Yes, there is family, there is friends as well. I am not leaving them out. But the whole idea of God existing is for us to have hope and faith in him and without acknowledging God how can we have hope how can we have that faith that everything will get better otherwise we will just think the worst all the time but it got to my baptism and I was obviously nervous for some reason I thought it would be a good idea to wear bright pink leggings, don't ask me why because I do not like the colour pink but at the time I did uh, and I probably just thought I don't like the colour pink so I'm just going to get these pink leggings wet and if they get ruined they get ruined, I don't care. <laughs> um, but I stood on the stage, I shared my testimony, I mentioned about my dad and we got given t-shirts saying I have decided I was going to get it and bring it to show you in the video but I don't know what I've done with it it's been years I don't know what I've done with it I know it's somewhere it's probably hidden in my drawers somewhere but there is something that I can tell you and that's the feeling that I got on that day and it's the kind of feeling that in your heart you know how you feel but you don't know how to describe it so as soon as I got baptised the atmosphere just completely changed to when I did my testimony. Everyone was clapping, cheering, celebrating the fact I got baptised, along with the others that I got baptised with. And when I went to meet with my family again after I got baptised, I just felt a whole load of love. I mean, I already do from my family, but... It was just a special moment because I had just done something that changed my life and the hug that I gave my mum as soon as I got out of the water was the best feeling ever. The same with when I hugged my brother and sister as well. It was just a special moment and... That's basically the full story. I could go on and on about it, but I feel like I will end up repeating myself. So I'm not going to go there. Um, so, 
yeah that was a special day despite my dad not being there i am glad i did it and i am sure that when i got baptized my dad was in heaven cheering me on just like he did when he was here and just having that thought in my own mind just relaxes me gives me peace and that's all that matters especially with what me and my family have been through and since I was young at the time it was important for me to have that peace because it was the kind of moment where I felt like I was growing up a bit too quickly so that was nice so when I said it was a good feeling it was a good feeling just take my word for it I'm sure you would know what I mean if any of you had got baptised or are thinking of getting baptised I will leave the video there and I will see you guys on my next video